My name is Rose Paula and I do live at Manor. My name is Glenn, I'm 12 years old. My name's Alex, I'm 19 years old. My name's Claire and I live at Manor. My name's Chris Kelly, I'm 16 years old. My name's Natalie Harrison, I go to a youth, well I did go to a youth group and it's called the Betsy's Bunch. My name's Kate Kelly, uh, I live on the Manor, I go to All Saints School and I am 12. My name's Torn, I live at 6 Castle Dale Croft, Lower Manor. At the end of my road, there's a dump where all dirty, creasy smackheads go. And I've had diggers, they call it. Another name for smack is heroin. And I'm sick of it. I, I never go out no more. It's too dangerous. Not a lot of things to do. I wish it was just a better place than what it is. There's too many, got too much glass about, too many vandals. No way to turn about or do anything. Too much graffiti front vandals we've got all over places, buildings, parks, they've burnt all parks down. They go, where do you live? And I go, man, they go, it's right, bad. And I go, yeah. I do get a bit scared for all people that are knock about around here and you don't know what they're going to do, so you don't know if they're going to jump out of somewhere and do something. There's like too many people knocking about on the streets. They either end up taking drugs or drinking. And then local people are scared to go out at night if they get mugged. There's loads of people around our end and they're always pinching cars. And they're always stood on the end of our road and they, they like stood there thinking, shall I have that car, shall I have that car? I know a lot of people that do crimes and I, and I said to them, why do you do it? It's like, wait, it's something to do, isn't it? It's boring around here, so it's something to do. New people don't have anywhere to go on the estate, so mm. they do hang around and then just get moved on. You sit on street corners, coppers like you up for breach of peace. So then they start causing trouble there and then they get moved on. So it's like vicious circle, weren't it? Until yeah. youth workers came on the estate and actually said, okay, what do you want to do? Basketball, football, and things like hockey, basketball, okay, basketball. Oh. football. I like football. Volleyball. And ball. Rollerblading. Rollerblading. Yeah, it's bantamish football, feet. but you just have to chuck it. We play it yeah. at school at PE in a gym like that. It's difficult to play my sports I want to play because there's too much class about like a little club thing like, do you know, for all acting? Mm. Using cameras. I don't need a work because I do a lot of that at school as well. I've made my own clothes at school and things like that. It's a place for me to work like the Commander Community Centre when it got done up. If it got done up, I would come down and do some work in it. My mum's got a baby and that and like, She's running about in Walker and that lot, and she's like, you know, like picking my homework up and that lot and taking it offside. My little brother and sister had me homework and um, I had all my things so I can't find them and I can't do them. And then when I get to go to school, when I get to get back to school, then get this, done. I always get done. Books with my homework? If we have a place for you to do his own homework, then it's going to be right quiet. And if we have somewhere to do his homework, then we could see some of his friends from school and help each other. And if they've got the support and the encouragement and the help to find out about the courses and the training, what they can have, I think it would make a big difference.
I don't come on at the centre because it keeps me away from what drug is. Not like a chilling room for older and like, you know, and like a disco. Like twelves and overs or something. Just a place to chill out at day and at night time. Well, I always hear everybody going to you going to youth club tonight. And there are, and there's like never one round here. Like, we just want loads of activities what we can do when it's raining and that and all. Because it keeps you out of streets. When you don't get done off coppers. That's mainly why people go vandaling and nicking cars and things like that. That's why they do it because they're bored on the streets and they've got no else to do. Do you know what little ones? They've got they've got a youth club here. But if if we had one like every like three days a week, then then maybe they wouldn't do it. Well, if I haven't been involved in them doing people's health project, I don't know what I'd be doing now to be honest. I have no idea because it's given me no, like, a whole new direction. If we could use this building, it'd make a lot of difference because a lot of people wouldn't fight anymore, a lot of people wouldn't get drunk, a lot of people, a lot of people wouldn't just like do crimes and that and thief and then if they've got somewhere to go then they're not going to do it, are they? I'd rather come in community centre than and sit at Anger Bar, sit on, like sit on the corner, you know, sitting on curbs and that, like I'd rather come Freezing. in here than do that in rain. It's going to make a big difference, it's building. Yeah.